Howdy yardy aliens and welcome! I'm Paul Yatesman. I draw stuff and lately I tend to post videos of everything I draw. In today's video, representing hashtag manga challenge day 5, I am drawing Eon Flux. Eon Flux started out as the name of a show and later the title character in an MTV Oddities liquid television short which aired around 1995. The Eon Flux series was created by Peter Chung. I really like how he draws in the series. I will be presenting my drawing as a time lapse. In real time, this took me about 80 minutes. I also think I killed the drawing in the last few marker strokes as my line art smudged and my extra ink provided some bad blending. It took me about 25 minutes to sketch out the base. I left the facial features until last as I considered that the hardest bit. I also misjudged the size again, so like yesterday's the max, this drawing extends off the page. While I was drawing this, I used some guidelines and feared I would botch the drawing by not being able to adequately replicate the look of the character. My fears eventually were unfounded. After sketching, I scanned in the drawing. I did not do the same after inking, probably as that bled into the colouring due to large areas of black which I coloured in using mostly cheap ass black texture. I'll have to try to remember to scan in before doing the colouring, just in case I want to fix things up after potentially wrecking it. The only thing that I could have done better, I think, in this piece is the hair colour. The reference screenshot I was working off has dark grey hair for the, I guess, highlights, and not the brownish colour that I used. Next time, perhaps. I'm thinking of trying my hand at some croquets in the Eon Flux body shape, so we'll see if I actually do that. I think the elongated shape of Peter Chung's characters would lend themselves nicely to this style of human form. For Eon's clothing, she gets the same BV00 as for the Max yesterday. I have a stack of Copics, though not many blue violets or red violets, but I do think the BV00 is perfect for this piece. For the brown hair, I thought it was a bit light and overlaid that with some warm grey. In hindsight, perhaps a dark neutral grey would have worked better. I was not overly precious about colouring the hair within the lines as I knew I would be blacking out other areas. When I did Eon's eyes, I used a bright blue, then added a big white gel pen circle on each for the highlights. I then added some lines to represent the irises, and I thought I may have ruined the eyes at that point, but they don't seem to be too distracting, so that was a success. Before colouring in the lips and skin, I tested some markers and decided on my RB11 for the lips, and then the E00 for the skin. Both of these, as for the BV00, seem to be perfect matches for the colours used in the TV show. The addition of shading on the skin is not what the cartoon has, but hey, artistic licence! Anywho, if you found this interesting, informative, entertaining, you got ideas for your own sketchbook or anything like that, subscribe, like and share. Until next time, you have been watching Drawing Stuff with me, Paul Yateman. Ciao, take care and happy drawing.